to the BBTV channel. We are here with another SmackDown vs. Raw 2008 GM Mode Series episode. I'm really excited to be doing this. We just got done with the podcast not too long ago. And so I'm trying to actually record a couple episodes uh, today for you guys. Because right now, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I, I'm trying, I'll be gone for like a week. So I'm trying to make sure that I'll you know, have everything prepared. But with that being said... We're still in third place, um, you know, we're not doing terrible, kind of. I don't know how Raw's in first place, their show's a mess. Um, like, legitimately speaking, where was, this was their show. half a star, two and a half, three stars, okay, I can actually say it being a three and a half star match. Damn it, never mind. Well, wait a minute. One, two, that's a star. They still don't have a three star show. I don't get where they're getting these ratings from. Like, th not even this is technically a three star show. But then if you look at mine, oh, never mind. Sorry. Mine from last week two and a half, two and a half, three, three. Almost all of my matches are, are... I was technically the closest one to a three-star last week. And look, look, look at this crap. At no point should this have been a three-and-a-half-star show. My pay-per-view, they skiffed me on. And yes, I felt some type of way. So yeah, we've, I've got a lot of ground to cover. But speaking of... This is this week's... Well, I guess one what the first episode of this week's episode. HBK will take on Kali, Mark Henry, and Stitch in a one-on-three handicap match. It's just to try to get them some type of um, experience. You just make them on the show and that way they, they don't leave. Um, next, we'll have a tag team match. Kane Umaga versus MVP and Mysterio with Sam at ringside. And then, after the promos, we need that. I just resigned a couple people. Uh, Triple Threat between Lashley, Jeff Hardy, and JTG. This is a rivalry match. And the Steel Cage. So, I will play three matches per show because why not? And we'll probably do three, four, and five, res respectively. So let's skip this, and then we'll skip this, and we'll start off with this one. Now, who do I want to win is the question. It's kind of hard to not go with JTG, but I think Bobby can use a win here. Because I'm trying to figure out, like, what am I going to do after this? Because, like, I think I found out the solution to my, um... It's my biggest problem. That being uh, my, oh my God, it's so loud in my ear. That being that my my microphone has a lot of wind sometimes when you're out of it. So I thought for the longest it was my PlayStation, my, my, my PS2. So, you know, when we finish the series um, later on this year, I'm just kind of waiting to see what I'll do is maybe I'll stick to 2008 and still do, like, instead of doing ECW, we'll do SmackDown? Yo, 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 or, yo. I don't know, like, we'll just check your I'll it's figure it out time. eventually. And the opponent from Brooklyn, New York. There's a JTG. For ECW, I'm, thinking about, I'm thinking heavily on bringing Shad to ECW later on in the series, you know? Of course, the man who can't stay drug free for the life of him, Jeff Hardy! Is that a bit of an insult? Which I don't think we had Jeff the last time we, we were um, here, so that that's pretty awesome. But half of me is like, if I were to do something like 2007, 2006, I don't think I'd want to do the gym. I feel like it'd be super fire to like a. Like a, um, like just, I don't know, just anything but a gym, like a universe mode. They have like the thing in there where you can like make certain, um, damn it. Where you can make certain, um, wow, I'm really drawing a blank today. I'm um, Bobby Lashley, I thought I was, J half of me thought I was JTG for a moment, the other half of me thought I was Jeff Hardy. Like, at no, at no part of my brain did it register that I picked Bobby Lashley. Great reversal. I'm surprised that worked. Pick him up and wreck him. Wreck the, wreck the junkie. Damn. I mean, they'd have that in the game. I'd say I'm this not match has lived up to expectations so far. Well, actually, you're gonna pick yes, up the air. Pick up the air. Sure. I'll tell you that right now. I can't wait to see how it ends. Ah. 
didn't press the right button. So JTG obviously wants to get some uh, momentum here, try to win a bunch of matches, try to, you know, get a shot at the Civil World title again, and at William Regal. William Regal has had JTG's number. Let's not forget that. This is not, ha this is, hasn't been an easy going for um, JTG. William Regal not only ruined his WrestleMania moment, he, he ruined the opportunity of JTG getting back into the title picture, or getting the title back, when we kick off the series, it really is, this season two has not been friendly to JTG. Yes, he's had a win at the pay-per-view, um, you know, barely legal, but besides that, one of those quiet what else can dudes, JTG when, uh, do? You know, we only got one title here on ECW, and down. you've got to be on top of your game at all times, not just when it's convenient. So, it's going to be interesting to see how, how this season uh, shapes up. Obviously, we have some returning you know, members of Team Bobby Lash being one of them, but... You know, with the older, with the old school ECW from season one, along with the new school ECW in season JTG two, I I'm, I'm can't wait to see just the comparisons and just how different they're going to be. Fans. Fans oh, on. he just countered me. Nah, we'll let Madison oh. get the victory. Go ahead, Jeff, do it. I knew you were going to do it. Oh, my God, Jeff Hardy. He saw that oh, one wow. Coming. Hey, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't do this double teaming stuff. Get suplexed. Oh, my Lord. Can you get suplexed? Ah, oh, you moved. But Jeff's already orange. It's great to have Jeff Hardy back in competition. No doubt that this nice. guy practically wrote the book on taking Whoa. risks and making a payoff. You sure can't. They see everything. Good. Go. Oh, you know you're so lucky. You reverse that one. Oh, Bobby, just keep punching him. Keep put. No. That's right. That is right. Bobby Lashley. I know you guys hear the buttons just like completely just getting mashed. But Bobby Lashley about to hit him with the Dominator. And you, DDT. Get out of here, punk. Chump, I should say. Oh, poor JTG. Oh, my goodness. Should I go to the top, Lashley? Go to the top. Can you get a move? Oh, you can't do the thing. I kind of want to pinch it for you. Jeff, get up. What's he going for here? Him with the second Looks dominator, like the and it's over. Good night, Irene. Yeah. Goodbye, Jeff. Like a real jerk Jeff is finished. He's One, two, three. JTG's probably still down. Yeah, JTG hasn't gotten up yet. Bobby Lashley did what he did. What he does best, he dominated. Point blank, period. Simple. He dominated. Why is the rock doing? I hate when they don't show like ECW stuff on ECW. Well, congrats to my boss for picking up a big win in this triple threat match. Here's your winner, Bobby. That's right, Bobby. That's right. Congrats to the big man, Bobby Lashley. Honestly, I really do love doing this series. Like, it's one time where I don't have to be. You know, I'd say over the top, but like super energetic. Like I just love being able to be chill and just enjoy the series with you guys. It's always been fun. Um, okay, what's it? What, what was that? Sabu, CM Punk. Oh shoot. That is interesting. This is interesting. Bam. Half me wants to use Sabu. Half me wants to use CM Punk. I think I'm going to use against my better judgment I'm going to use Sabu I know Sabu lost if I'm going to keep him at a decent popularity I've got to have him win these type of matches because like I said you know the first couple the first two pay-per-views I was never a fan of in, in this mode because they really do they throw the first pay-per-view from ECW on you like it's nothing what is the world what is this
if you guys hear a whole phone call conversation. So, <laughs> see you, bye everyone. But anyway, like I said, I just I'm not a big fan of um, the first three. I, I'm not for the first two pay per views. So like it's hard to build because unless you build to to one night stand, then you're gonna have like the same matches, you know. Unless you do like a, a four way, I was like I just I didn't want to do that, especially not because we have to build these guys' popularity up like immensely. And then try to keep four guys popularity wise at least over an eighty. Just it wouldn't have been. I mean, it would have been feasible if I would have done it differently. But with Regal being our champion, it just wasn't gonna work. I'm, I'm okay. I'm sad. Was it Oops. What was that? Oh, what is? The, oh, you ruined my Watch phone. It. Darn it. it. Do it again. Yeah, helicopter spit. Oh, you, you, you know what? You're a bus. Oh, good. Nope. Huh? Points. Oh, I thought I was gonna point to this guy. Show off for the crowd all you want, but all that does is let your yeah, opponent rest sad, up. Sad, I'm sure this superstar would argue the benefits of feeding off of the audience. Yeah. There we go. Points before, to the sky. I'll say it again. Nothing costs you a match quicker than overconfidence. Oh, it's over his head. His head. His head. His head. Bounced right over the 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 floor. Good lord. That would have killed them. Talk about adding insult to injury, and these fans love it. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult. If I tell you, he's not saying it. He's taking a little time to get to this guy after every move. Mind. You know something? I'm not really sure if he can spare it. Good punk. Oh, I didn't mean lit. Oh, I didn't mean literally. Do it again. Right for the fans. Points to the wants, sky. But if it cost him the match, his opponent will have the last laugh. I oh, think he's going oh, to risk that. The second, the second time. The second time. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Nice reversal. Right now. Yeah, okay, we're getting out of there. Terry, do something. Sabu can be credited. With bringing tables into the ring, yeah. and then putting his opponent's yeah, even you're my partner, credited actually, or blamed, probably should not have done that. Depending your perspective, Sabu forced everyone to step up their game. That's what being extreme is all about. Come on, you don't win a match by that, that, That's what they're supposed to do. Not technically, but getting the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological boost. Yeah. Let's see here, and what is he doing? What is he doing? Ref, how are you allowing this? CM Punk spent many years honing his craft before making it here to the big time. He's just got it locked up. You step up your game once you get a spot here. Oh, thank God I did that. And yes, I did have to do that. The ref got hit. I think he's going to be out of it if, for some time. If he the would have got out, that would have been disqualification. Like to, it would have been a disqualification, folks, I'm telling you. That would have been so bad. You know, Regal? I don't think I like right now. That's right. Go after the the man you're going to face at ECW One Night Stand for the ECW World no Heavyweight title. On the face of this superstar. Yeah, that and 50 cents will get you a cup of coffee. Holy hell. Oh, Jesus. He can do that. Heck yeah. Right. Let me get out of here, though. Something for the fans. That's why they love him. You know what? But who cares what they think? All he's doing here is giving his opponent a chance to recover. This is a... Oh, we hit him. We hit it. We landed it. <laughs> yes, I'm going to take my small victories. Whoever thought we'd be Let's pulling this match together. Hey, partner? Okay, does he have one where he just sprint? Right. Holy hell, Sabu. This is amazing. How am I just figuring this out? Like I literally had you all that season one, reversal. and we did. Well, that's just, we didn't even feature you in any real programs. That's probably why. Now looking back, on, I don't think I, I featured Sabu in anything. No, he was in a title match. I think once that we aired. Oof. I think CM Punk is tired of my tomfoolery. If I told you, it wouldn't be a secret, now would it? Jeez. Okay, yeah, great. What you get? Yep, great. right now, there. Now, why don't you quit showing off and get down to business here? He is getting down Before to business. He's in the sports entertainment I business, don't... isn't he? 
Sabu, Sabu, oh heck, ah, oh, come on. Got him up right place, right time stuff. Come here. How lucky are we? As you guys tell me, having a blast. <laughs> Just messing around entirely. Well, I'm glad that that worked for you. Boom! Who doesn't love that? Oh, oh, ref. oh, 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 damn it, I thought I had it, I thought the ref has been punched, kicked, dragged, you name it. How? I, I, I rebuke in the name of our Lord and Savior. Oh, never mind. And are not the like, not the like, CM Punk, I swear if you get this man injured, I will make sure I put you on Raw right next to The Rock. You won't ever have, oh, you won't have another freaking. We're here to provide commentary. Talking's kind of our job. I, I don't got to Also, notice my No, no, I want to do the thing where he like kicked and spun. Where was that at? I probably shouldn't be trying to just figure out cat. Oh, oh, well, that happened. Sabu is a trooper. He has taken a if lot lives of damage. Up to his nickname, I'm just like, he's it's Sabu. just been... He really is. So much can go wrong from that top turnbuckle. There we go. And yes, I am determined to hit these crazy moves with him because... That reversal oh. might stop his opponent's oh. Oh. momentum dip. Oh, good lord. Where is this coming from? I understand you just got fired from AW. You know, looks like they've come in here. Shirk over here. Up their game. Yep. But the ladder of success goes both ways. On the losing side, that means a trip down oh, one road. To I think he's gonna fly. I don't even know. It's not even know if it connected. I, I just couldn't tell. There it is. I, I think his is the camel clutch. The fans have certainly taken to CM Punk. He's Look one of the most beautiful. popular superstars That puts him perfectly, in perfectly in position. Campbell clutch to CM Punk. But he embodies it's over. the true spirit of extreme championship wrestling. The fans know whose backs ECW what? was built on, but they also recognize who the future of the brand is. Dang, he has been hanging in there. Oh. It sure was a long, uh, strange no, trip to no. get these oh, superstars to square off like this. No doubt. The yeah, shortest look at this break with two points may be a straight line, but I find this way more entertaining. I'm with you, partner. And now they're here to put on a great show for all of us. You feel like a real jerk when somebody counted you like that. I don't think so. I have not been able to... Uh oh my god, CM Punk? Is generally a problem for Sabu. No. That would be a really good time to stop wearing down a body part. I say go for the leg. Is that like a That's manager? amazing foreshadow because he was a manager for a while. Nah, I'd be too tempted to jump in that ring and start choking people out. Finally, that move. I'm not one to judge a match with stars, but th this is going to be big. Does one he way really or the other. The camel clutch. Well, at least he, he did the right thing there. What kind of preparation goes what? into a match like this? What? He, he got out of the camel clutch. Travel and mental anguish. Uh, These athletes don't just chill out on a couch wow. between matches. I know that partner, and I have the Damn utmost it. respect for them nope. because of it. That's not the move I originally went for. I was hoping to counter it, and it just so happened to be. Wait till I find out what if Sabu has another freaking. Oh, uh, uh, well. I think everyone's gonna leave the arena with a smile on their face. Not everyone. Remember, someone's got to lose, and losing's not fun. I mean, this Good is like point. an actual competitive match. I, I wasn't expecting star. this from. I also can't tell 
where is it coming from? Because Punk has generally done a lot of reversals. I've had many, 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 many wars with Sabu, and let me tell you, no one can oh. take you to the limit ah. like that guy. You're not kidding. In all my years in this business, I have not seen anyone come down the pike quite like Sabu. What is... He's got this crowd solidly behind him, and now he's going to give them exactly what they want to see. I say you pay more attention to whoever you're squaring off with and leave the fans alone until the match is won. Nice neckbreaker. Okay, okay. Damn, CM Punk. I'm ECW through and through, and I can't tell you how glad I am that we got kids like CM Punk representing the brand these days. I'm with you on that. Punk would have fit. Right. That's the way you do it. Nothing like the side of your own blood to take the fight He's right out of you. There's no way. There's just no way. It feels to see your very life force pouring down your face. I've been Thank God. I was like, my goodness. Like he just didn't want to tap. Before. At no point did he want to tap. I was in the whole time. Like, he's got to quit at some point. For, like, what the heck? And dude was just not trying to quit. I don't know why. Here is your winner. Congrats to Sabu, who narrowly made it again. Na narrowly made it out against CM Punk. Meanwhile, Terry Funk and Will and Ring have to sit there and wait to get their hands. I mean, CM Punk did a great job against Sabu, but, um, you know, if CM Punk's going to do that for now, and CM Punk's going to get my, my darn nerves. That's what he really going to do. I suppose a steel cage match between Edge and Randall Keith Orton. Ooh, we're going to go with the ultimate opportunist for sure. On this day, I see clearly. That's all I got for you. My uh, musical ability is quite limited, folks. You think you know me. Speaking about that, here we go. Steel Cage made event in the first show we have in this episode. Edge, everybody. And I think we're like a couple... We're like two episodes away from the pay-per-view. And ladies and gentlemen, he is the one and only Randall Keith Orton. Show the pyro, baby. Boom. Nothing you can say. Nothing's gonna take what you've done to me. Yeah. I think he did a great job. Come on, game. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Aha. And there's the reversal. Dang it. Got him, Edge. Twist the. Uh, uh, oh, okay. No, no, go, go, go. Run up the wind. Run like hell. We're getting out of here. It looks as if he's headed up. No, we're not. <laughs> you failed, Ben. You failed. Oof. Watch it. He reversed it. So I don't think I changed the rules for this one. Now we're good. He wants out of this unforgiving steel cage. And who can blame him? Get out, get out. He yeah, yeah, yeah we did it. <laughs> this could be oh, it. we did it. The ultimate opportunist getting out of there in record time. Look at Randy, like, bro, what the hell? You think you know me? Congrats to Edge in a hard fought victory right here in the main event of VCW and the Steel Cage match. It took literally multiple spears to put Orton away. Hold on, like this. Over Colorado Springs. Honestly, I'm wondering, is it Colorado a good area to 
It's got a oh. good area to um to move to. Eight forty. There we go. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, they gave us a three star. Hey, they didn't shaft me for once. Holy hell, they didn't shaft me. That feels like amazing. Like literally, I feel like I actually deserved my three star more than this crap. And yes, I feel some type of way. I have no problem admitting that. Orton and Edge went up to an 80. That's pretty cool. Lashley didn't go up at all. Kazinga G didn't go down. Jeff went down as well, people? Question mark. I'm wondering, because like I like having Mark Henry and like, you know, Great Collies. I kinda wanna keep the Great Collie. But if I were to get rid of Mark Henry and Snitchki. For them here, what are their ratings looking like? I feel like the one person who should be here is him, and I'd be easily willing to give. Oh, wait a minute, what's his? He's on a five-week contract. Oh, I just hit my mic. He's on a five-week contract, and as like appealing as that may sound, I don't. I don't know if I like that or not. It's like I would like to get um, Shad here, I really would. But probably right now, probably not the best time. He's on a five weeker. <clears throat> He's on a five weeker, and I just extended these guys for five weeks. I, I don't want to give SmackDown when they can't, then they don't have to um, extend. So we'll, we'll bide our time with that one. But it doesn't help who I actually have to push to, to put popularity on. I know Sabu obviously was probably going to be one of the first, but not really. Actually, I'll probably put it to Ray. Because um, if, I, if, I, if, I if, I, if I work my way from the bot, from the top down, I think life will be a little bit easier. We'll have better matches, you know, from our main event guys. And I can use them in better spots for lower end guys, which... I know before I did it differently where um, I used the, the lower end guys first and then the top guys, but I'd rather save my keister and, and do it low, uh, top end to lower end. I think that'll uh, help and you know, a multitude of, of ways, of course. He's an 81, he'd do this for about two weeks, then I do Sabu, I should be looking pretty decent. Let's go, Ray. I think Ray cannot crack five fans, huh? All right, here we go. Five energy, big success. What are we looking at for a 995? 95, so in like two more times, he'll, he'll be good. <laughs> Which is perfect. It's, it's what I wanted, so. That's just amazing in its own right. Literally. Sabu will actually be healthy in a week, which is awesome. Now, the fun stuff. WV.com, here we go. Fan change for ECW? Wow. Four stars. Screw you. Hold on, let's go back over here. They're getting even larger in these. How are they doing this? I don't understand. But I didn't lose fans, I don't think. So I guess they can't be too mad. Ray's gone up. Regal went down. Sean's gone up. Oh, shoot. Okay. There's none of our guys in the top 25. Like, none of them are. <laughs> it's so sad. They have a two and a half star show. They, I, you're joking me. How do they have a four star show when they don't even have what? What is this? What the fuck happened here? 
What is this atrocity of a match? How the fuck is this three stars? <laughs> First of all, poor Kelly Kelly. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How is this fair for Kelly Kelly? Well, for, well we should probably talk to Tori too, but how is this? Wait, she actually wrestled. Oh my God. What was wrong with these people? That I can imagine would have been a really good match though. That's what they've reduced Roddy Piper to. Oh my God. How did they win? How did Melina? How? First of all, who does this stuff? I mean, congrats to Candace and Pin the Rock, but still. And how are my shows bad? See, here we need a title defense. We need a title defense. I cannot go against Judgment Day when they just run a four-star main event. It's just not possible. Um, title hype, and I want slandering. Lots of slander. Main event for the ECW title. Right here tonight. One on one. Sorry, wait. We gotta have... Um, who is he feuding with? I don't think we need to him. Hold on, let's not do that. But I gotta look back at the rocks. Like, who are you feuding with again? Oh, Sabu. How did I, how did I forget that? How did I get compelled to forget that? Wow. Sabu won't be wrestling because I want to make sure he's healthy. That's even better. So yeah, Regal will defend his title. And I could do Bobby Lashley. He has been on a roll, Lashley. I'm not going to lie. So that's not terrible. Um, like at all. I don't think anyone else. I mean, maybe we could put him against Ray. We'll put what we'll, we'll do Regal versus Ray. I was gonna say Lashley, but I'd rather do Regal versus Ray just for the sake of popularity, and it gives Regal. One more title defense, which is like even better to add to his belt and his two time uh, reign as champion. Or his second reign as champion, sorry. Alright, so that's the East Every Championship match, which is great. Um, next up, because we really, 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 really have to have a solid show. Um, we could do a tag team match between the other two. Actually, I'm I'm here for that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let's do that. CM Punk versus Terry Funk. CM Punk, and then we'll switch it up. Randy will have to be in. No, Randy's not gonna want to work with Bludgeon Bay. Brings the yeah, Randy's not gonna want to work with himself. By the way, just letting you know. No, I think that's perfect. I think this right here um, encapsulates. What what I just said? Encapsul. Cap. What's the word? Holy hell, I don't remember the word. I'll, I'll remember it eventually. But yeah, we'll definitely do that. I think that kind of showcases the rivalries pretty well here. I like that. Okay. Match three. I want a singles match. I kind of want to rerun Lashley and Michaels. But I don't yeah we're gonna rerun that no no i think lashley versus jtg should be over here yeah let's do lashley versus jtg as like a singles match um sean can kick things off. if nine sorry four seven nine do 11 of these yes okay do another singles match here as will she Shawn michaels take on wow they're all gone uh where is sandman is he there heck yeah Shawn michaels versus the sandman Sandman looks beyond freaking bewildered at this point. Good lord. And then to keep people happy, 
we will do this. So I can use five. I probably don't want to use five though. I probably just use four. And what we'll do is make it. We'll make we'll make another tag team match. We'll make another tag team match. And and this side. Jeff Hardy. And this side, Kane. Uh, so we use Sabu, Samu, Terry Funk, Jeff Hardy. Yep, no, Jeff Hardy and Kane versus the Great Kali versus MVP. Actually, let's just throw in. Screw it. Not, it's not hurting to not throw them in. And then we'll actually use. Where's the great belly? So we can actually use this to kind of give him a win. Be like, actually, well, let's, let's put a VP over here. And then we'll switch it around to where Jeff, Kane, and perfect. That to me right here, perfection. Crap, it's a tag team, but, uh, Jiminy Crickets. Gonna have to do. I was gonna play this one too, but I guess not. So we'll skip this one and this one. All right, that works. Let's confirm. We'll skip this. Please say yes, the right team won, thank the heavens. Thank you. We'll skip this one. JTG says, I'm bouncing back. I don't know about you, Bobby, but I am bouncing back. We'll do this one first because it, we've technically seen this type of feud. Uh, who won? CM, I think CM Punk does need to win this one, and I think Orton does too, so we'll go with them. We'll go with the heels on this one. Punk Funk. The unk, oh no, that sounds terrible. Funk, punk the funk. No, what? what? We got to find a good name with that. We've got it. Like, ah, that kills me. It really does kill me right there, ladies and gentlemen. Hall of Famer, Terry Funk. The following tag team contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring. You think you know me? Hey, so his tag team partner, Edge. So we're gonna skip their entrance mainly, and as soon as he comes out, see him poke everybody back. Yeah. It's going to take ages, question mark. Come on. Come on. Are you going to go after a legend? Oh, never really thought he was going to go after a legend. That was a textbook reversal. Oh, we can't. We gotta keep that right there. Is gonna be a great match at one night stand. Oh, real I nice. He can't win for that fair match. and square, so he screws his way to a victory. Hey, look, there's nothing wrong with him doing whatever it takes we'll to win the match. That. If it was we'll that bad, right the right right? Right? see what you. Damn, you're so slow. So there we go. Take it to him. I think he's got the knee, right? You no, or is that until he's set I guess when he had like a knee that he like. Elegantly Easier drops down. On the way to a victory, but I might be wrong. Let's you. try it again. Let's drop him here. Uh, hey. You know, instead of show on, to the fans, maybe you should really keep your head to this match. Rake the eyes, Randall. Tinge of jealousy. Maybe you didn't always get that kind of reaction from the audience. He dropped him. Uh, I mean, wow. 
Great flat on his head. He's got this crowd Drop him. There we go, Randall. There we go, crowd. Exactly what they want to see. I say Whatever that move is on the, on the right hand, hand like, or the side. The Terry Funk has reversed like every reflexes. single time. I, bet he plays like I don't think the fans like that one too much. <laughs> Here's the cover. And I'm curious on what it is. I have to know. Right, hit him with the RKO. Really watch out for your it's over, folks. Oh, man. Here he comes. RKO! RKO! It's over. One, two. Right One, two. You are that's right, Red. You are with the referee. some bad news for these fans. Uh oh, the ref is on Dream Street. That's the whole point. Look at what Randy's got. Randy. Oh no. not all of them. This could be chaos. He swung it for the fences with that sledgehammer. Talk about bringing that hammer down, but good. Oh man. Nice one. Edge instead. He's looking for his finishing maneuver. All KO. Right there right there that is not what right Edge there. wants to feel. He's hit that R he got hit with that RKO really and oh. this guy's head. The fans See him punk is this he, they, oh, they want they want really good reason. Room for real. Aren't you a face, dude? No, I made Randy hit the, uh, hit the face. Uh. Edge never met a rule he didn't break. Happily. He's going up. And what you waited? Up you jerk. Come down. You waited? I think I have a bigger problem story about Terry. Oh. Hey, you ever thought about becoming a wrestler? Or what they call in this company, an in-ring competitor? Uh, considering the fact that I'm afraid of my wife, I haven't really thought about it that much. I don't know, man. You'd be tough to catch in that ring. Kind of like a greased up shaved cat with mayonnaise on his face. Try to see if I can get the ref out. This is human chest, man, <laughs> and he thought one move ahead. Look out! We've got a zebra out cold. Well, you know the old expression when the cat. That was away, great teamwork. Cannot tell if that was intentional. There we go. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. We found it. We found it. Yes. RKO. It's over. Ref should be up by now. One ref, one, two, the ref. What a wicked execution! Edge, you idiot! Edge, the Edge messed it up. Congrats, Edge, you idiot! Punk and Orton are victorious, and RKO to Terry Funk is all it took, and maybe a couple sledgehammer shots, but it was an RKO mainly. Congrats to CM Punk on the radio and on winning this match. Here are your winners. There we go. Randy Orton. And CM Punk. And I genuinely wouldn't know. I've only done ECW. <laughs> So it was a nice break from that. Shawn Michaels and the Sandman. Because I'm a giving person, let's give the Sandman an upset victory over HBK. Because I think that would do a world a world of uh, of good, honestly. Shawn Michaels is here in this episode, everybody. Here is the heartbreak kid, HBK. He can feel it, folks. He feels you. Shawn Michaels up and down there. Shawn that crowd popped though for Shawn. Let's see, they popped for. Uh... Honestly, I think they're crap. They're popping louder for the same man than the HBK. This is, this, is, this, is, this is easily at least a tie. 
they're kind of popping for the Sandman. Do what you gotta do, Sandman. Go ahead, do. Yep, there we go. Go ahead, Sandman. Ladies and gentlemen, the Sandman. He, how did he duck under that punch? You know what? What, what was that, Sandman? This is not. Oh, it's over. The punch of what? What? He doesn't. No, pin him. There we go. Sandman just needs to be redirected. Pin his opponent right here. One, two. Man, his opponent looked like a punk with that counter. Arm drag. Man, this match kind of makes me miss competing in the ring myself. Try, I wouldn't try jump in there right you, now. Those oh. superstars are really going at it. Maybe you're right. How about I just smack you around a try little bit? Simmons. Nope. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get into a fist fight, Sean. Oh, maybe. Maybe he did. Maybe he did. Backbreaker. There. Ooh. I hope the fans know they're getting something special tonight. They better. It's not every day you get to see a matchup like this. No, no, what is his finish? Great for? reversal! Yeah, that's bad it's been so long. I don't remember some of these guys. I could have sworn it was a pile driver. Like, I could have sworn it was a pile driver. I don't know. He's putting a lot of now, the I line like going the up there. I am convinced it's an off the top rope move. I don't know why I'm just convinced. Nope. Whoever thought we'd be calling this match together? Hey partner, no fooling. Oh. Oh. for nothing. I wonder why I got heat with to be stuck with you. Let's see that. There's a dude with guts. These top rope moves are risky. Is it a running maneuver? Is it a next to the ropes? I have no is it it doesn't tell me in this game. Is it like a has had several big teammates in the past. Triple H, John Cena, not to mention the big guy. And I'm not talking about the big fan. The, uh, like... No, that's that's Terry Funks. I think. I I, I, I generally don't know. Trip to get these superstars to square off like this. No doubt. The shortest distance between two points may be a straight line, that was but I find this way more entertaining. I'm with you, partner, and now they're here to put on a great show for all of us. Heck and yeah, it looks like he's been caught. Sean, get your steam blooded up quite often. Chances. I don't know about that. Sometimes seeing your own blood pumps you up even more. Your adrenaline stops. That knee, that running knee is gonna actually connect there. And Sean Michaels, like, you think that's gonna work on me? An injury like that could become serious, especially if the match goes on much longer. Is it not the legs? What in the hell is it? I don't, I don't know what it is. Common with his style and his looks. Neither are pretty. Well, well, matches aren't beauty pageants, uh, uh, and they certainly aren't judged on style points. Well, there goes your chance to make it bigger I'm in sure business. I'm sure like, someone will tell me what the same end's finisher is. Eventually. Sean's saying you're not gonna build me. This capacity crowd definitely has their favorite in this contest. Having a respect and Dang it, I was trying to see. I, great, I wish that rules were as easy as they were in 23. You a rush to hear the fans the cheering and chanting for you? Yeah, I definitely think it was pretty cool. Hey, get up here, buddy. It's going for the backdrop off the top. Not good for Sean. Oh! What's going through the minds of I think he landed on the back of his head. We're going to go for the pen. I think he knocked himself out. One, two. Sean is history. Yes, he is. The Salmon with the victory.
big upset victory for for uh, Sandman here. Congrats to the Sandman. Here's your winner. He's losing. Congrats, Sandman. Biggest upset probably in the history next to William Riggle beating Bobby Lash in a tankless match for the Stephanie title. Speaking about William Regal, the real extreme gentleman himself will defend the ECW Championship against Rey Mysterio. And you got to think too, if Mysterio is able to defeat William Regal here tonight, that means that our main event wouldn't then be a three-way match if Regal is to, you know, invoke that rematch clause. If not, it would be Regal versus Sabu at one night stand for the Stevie title. Can Rey Mysterio play spoiler to William Regal's plans here tonight and become ECW World Heavyweight Champion? Is it the time for Rey Mysterio? And speaking about it. People's time, ladies and gentlemen, it's definitely his time, all right. He is your reigning, defending ECW World's Heavyweight Champion. He is the real extreme gentleman, William Regal. Can he survive Ray Mysterio tonight, much like he survived Shawn Michaels at Barely Legal? this one <laughs> get back Louis. oh a textbook reversal can he follow up no I'm just gonna get some higher high flying already. I'm just trying to choke him out. These competitors seem a little tentative. That was in smart there. from Regal. Going right, right back to it. Yep. I guess you're right, partner. Every time you go to inflict punishment, there's a chance it'll be inflicted I like on what, what Regal's instead. doing here. He is keeping Rey Mysterio grounded, but he should not try to taunt Rey He's Mysterio. This could be it. That's the battle of grapples here. I don't think we're going to win this one, though, with William Regal. Go for the stretch. Regal's done a great job trying to wear down. I would say he Regal was going to try. He was wearing down this year quite well. Story. He grew up on the streets and became a distinguished gentleman. We should all be very proud of him. That may have to be a more respectable accomplishment if he hadn't stepped keep on everyone's mat. heads keep, keep, on keep his way ground, up the Down mat. to the mat, Regal. You know what you gotta do. We're still trying to fight back on the real extreme jump. Look at those right hand shots. I don't know how that reached. I think the elbow hit him. Oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think it's time to bring out the heavy firepower. These superstars got it in them to cause a lot of damage. Believe me. Top rope moves. I think trying to just add insult to Rey Mysterio here, trying to insult him. Insult that high flying luchador style. But let's root go right back to it. I don't think he's trying to necessarily submit him. He's trying to stretch him, trying to hurt him, trying to tear some ligaments. Like I said, it's a diabolical plan from the real extreme gentleman. I think everyone's going to leave the arena with a smile on their face. Not everyone. Remember, someone's got to lose, and losing's not fun. Good point. That's the price you pay to be a superstar. Yeah, Regal at this point is going to see Sabu. Sabu came to the Regal earlier. I think we're going to make him pay. One. Man, this match kind of makes me miss competing in the ring myself. I wouldn't jump in there yeah, right now. Those oh, oh, wait, wait, really oh. going at it. Maybe you're right. I'm going to just smack He knows that right. obviously Rey Mysterio and Sabu are, are actually kind of friends here. So Regal trying to play all that. Wait, he's going to... 
He's not gonna push his face in, is he? Wait a minute! Oh! The wicked stepsister! This capacity crowd definitely has their favorite this contest! Not on the outside! Ah, not on the outside! Not on the outside! Good lord! Didn't it give you a rush to hear the fans cheering and chanting? And right here on the outside, right where the ref couldn't see it, Sabu, not happening. He can't do anything necessarily about it. And Rigo trying to make sure he gets a shot in on Sabu. I mean, Fed said like said, Ramos are now not in a good way. That was brass knucks hit him. And quite literally, not a good thing. Mysterio, that thing's been busted right open. That used to get me in blood in the water, baby. The end is near. The risk these competitors take is a testament to their toughness. Hey, if this was easy, every Tom, Dick, and Joey would try to get in the ring. This is no joke. So I'm just trying to avoid him get even blooded up even more. Is that counter from Mysterio? But how much damage has been done? Really, is trying to really to wear out Rey Mysterio in every way, shape, and form. And now he's blooded up. Ooh, hit him right in the nose. And doom! Oh, locked and loaded. Here it comes. Wow. The the power of the walking away. Connect. What a shot! Wait, I mean, he's got the ace in every title. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, referee. You need to get involved here. I was talking to one of these superstars before the show, and they let me in on a little secret strategy we're planning for tonight. And that strategy was? If I told you, it wouldn't be a secret, now would it? Jeez. Uh, I wonder why nobody trusts you. Regal took out the ref. Regal took out the ref. But Mysterio, though, he is not getting up. The ref got hit. I think uh, he's, gonna he's getting be up. For Mysterio's going to have no idea. Oh, wait a minute. Mysterio's saying no. This kind of not today. Oh, uh, Regal still got the title. All Regal's in him with it. Oh, man. I don't think that was ever meant to be used like that. Creativity has And the ref see nothing. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. The ref has Nothing no idea what's happening. Match quicker than overconfidence. All I see is a dominant ah, superstar who's rallying this capacity crowd behind him. Really? Ray, I just need to do one thing. Get in the corner. And don't! the minds of these combatants right now? About a million different things. Here's the deal. You've got to think several steps ahead of your opponent. Look out. Oh, my couple. goodness. Well, William Regal cracked Rey Mysterio the with up. the ECW title. It's over. I don't. I think Mysterio's honestly out of it. He may get the three He's history. Right here. Let the ref can get up now, please. Ref. You can count to seven here, buddy. Regal not happy, but Mysterio's still out. Mysterio's done. Ray Mysterio, it's over. One, two, three. Son of a gun. William Regal retains the ECW World Heavyweight Championship. William Regal still being the, the real extreme gentleman. Not only that, but is still your ECW champion. And he used what he could to his advantage. Seen the opening through there free in front of Rey Mysterio. Hit him, hit him, already hit him with the title previously. The ref didn't even take it out of there. And instead, the ref went down, Regal picked him up and clocked him with that title. William Regal retains the ECW World Heavyweight title right here tonight in the main event of ECW. Congrats to the real extreme gentleman. My goodness. Regal, Sabu, yeah? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No, 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 no. It suffered from a concussion. Will have roughly impact on his performance for one week. Okay, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. He did get bloodied up, which we probably should have like, seen him coming. 
So it was now 100%, which is great. So we just, we were having minor injuries, which is, you know, not the worst. I mean, I'd rather, rather, you know, other thing. Wait, we had a three and a half star, half star shot. Three and a half. Three and a half. Two and a half, three and a half. So that's a three and three, 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 four. We had a four. Ooh, we had a four. We had a four, ladies and gentlemen. It's about time they give me some darn credit. And watch SmackDown just supersede me this episode this week. Was it this time? They're gonna supersede me, I guarantee it. I guarantee it. some popularity. Mysterio went down. I thought so, but hey, I had a good championship match. So what we'll do here. We'll do Mysterio twice, and then we're going to work on Sabu. Sabu's got to be able to, you know, gain popularity for that pay-per-view. Plus five. Well, he didn't really need plus five, but it would have been nice the first time, but I'll take it this time. All right, Sab, here you go. Don't make me so forced with some of your health, yeah. That's what we'll do for Sabu, especially. Plus five, let's go. What? Oh. Smackdown? 400, Jesus Christ, 400,000 fans. We had a three and a half star show. Cut me. They had a three and a half star pay per view, though. What? How? Green. Two star, three, three and a half, four. Uh, I can't be mad. I can't even be mad. Damn. Yep, they they did that. I don't know how this is three and a half star, but they they did it and then somehow. Damn. How the hell did Ashley beat Marcus Corbon? How did that happen? Who allowed that to happen? It's like the burial of Marcus Corbon. Let's see where our guys are at. Ray, Sean. Good, 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 good. They're doing their thing. William Regal, for some reason, got more, it seems. Except it was at 91, <clears throat> which is awesome for me. Which is awesome. I like that already. Heck yeah. Okay. So they're still on 80, which is nice. Bobby didn't really lose anything. Terry didn't lose anything. Uh, some guys are going up, which is nice. Mago went down. MVP went up again. One up by two. Why is that? Oh, another four. I think that's why. And up, Kali, I think, went down one. I, could, I can't really tell. They haven't been used for one week. I'm really not used. Okay. So, my guy makes one three matches. Wow. Wouldn't have guessed that. Okay. Okay. This isn't terrible. We're doing pretty good. Ah. Health report, though, for the most part, it looks like, besides Mysterio, you know, Sabu is, I mean, Sabu is healthy again, which is great. So I knew that King of Extreme thing was going to affect me, but hey, that's what it is. Oh, I also did not check Power 25. William Regal's back up there. Sean went down one. Bram Mysterio went up there. Huh. 
take that Raw and SmackDown with three guys in the top or even ah, top five. Like fan support wise, we actually went up some. So SmackDown had a 3.2, Raw's had a 3.1. We actually went up by a couple fans here. We're at a 2.7. Even though it's saying we're going downward, which is kind of weird. I can't really tell what is happening in that like you know, in that sense. So a bit awkward there. Let's hit save data, thank you. Thank you. Come on. Cool. I'm going to check to our rivalries real quickly. What well, I mean is they're four we're four weeks into the six week rivalry and I mean it's looking pretty pretty good. Uh for for the most part we are looking very, very good here. And that's really awesome. This is looking good, number tender. Loser leaves the brand is looking really good. I, I love that for these two especially. Awesome, just freaking awesome, okay. Okay. What we will do is we will raise, raise your nipples. So if I rest somebody, that might be a problem. I don't think, um, where's Ray? Oh, they took, uh, what's it, they took Ray out from? That's not cool. All right, we'll see the paper here, I'm gonna move that for right now. We'll do that for the, um, for the event. We'll do it, I do want finances for both, so we will, and, and, Increases backstage pop, pop popularity. You know what? We will do that for CM Punk. Give him some mic time. In our main event. Did I put all these three guys together recently? No, did I do it here? I did do it here. Damn it. Okay, okay. If I were to do something else, that wouldn't work either. So we've got two weeks left for this moment. That's what I'm gonna do. Is we're gonna give them Huh. I kinda wanna do a hardcore triple threat tonight with tag match, but I really can't do that. I mean I can, but do I want to? No. What I am gonna do is force people to work together. When they don't want to. That is something we're definitely going to do on the next episode. So William Regal will have to team up with Sabu if they want to win. And Edge and Randy Orton are going to have to team up if they want to win. In our main event, that's going to be an interesting one. Oh yeah. Definitely. Over here... We'll put CM Punk and Terry Funk in a first blood match. Because both guys don't have any fatigue, so we can do that. So that'll be a first blood match between those two in match two. And the match two slot. I'm looking forward to that one. It gives it adds just another layer to their to their problems. And so yeah, definitely looking forward to this. So I need to I can really apply it to their match and help. Over here, Rey Mysterio will be in one on Ken casual one on one action. And we will have him go up against. Want someone good. We'll do Mysterio versus Sean. We won't play that one. I know it's kind of like a repeat, but for the sake of trying to keep Rey Mysterio healthy. We'll do Mysterio vs. Sean. I think it's been a while since I did that. I think it was like the first episode I think that I did that, right? Which one was it? I had one where I did Mysterio vs. Sean. Mysterio vs. Funk. Mysterio vs. Lashley. Mysterio vs. <laughs> was it here? No. I had to have done it. It couldn't have been. 
we have ne I have never done Ray well Ray Mysterio versus Shawn Michaels will be right over here. Perfect. That's their first time. I thought I did it before, but that will actually probably a match we play now because that sounds pretty freaking epic. Heck yeah. So Ray and Sean will be over there. Oh, I could do the same for whatchamacallit too. Oh, we're definitely gonna do that. We'll do the same for them. Oh, I can't because I don't have it. Never mind. So the one on one match, Bobby Lashley is gonna go one on one. I will do this. Or with Jeff Hardy. Yep, there we go. Lashley versus Jeff, which I think is a pretty good one. And then over here, so we have how many slots left? Two, four, six, ten. We can definitely do a six man. I normally do six man, so I don't know what that means. They make him elimination style, because MVP is kind of like a winning streak, and I guess he's organically going up. We'll, we'll use him. Um, let's see here. So we used him, used him. Kane, I think, won last week, so that's good. And then, so let's use Kane again on, our, on this side. Then over here will be poor Maga. Maga, Kali. This Kali is just gonna keep losing, I guess. Because why not? And the Sandman can come over there. Even though I think it would be better if I had Sandman with them. No, no, we can keep Sandman over there. So yeah, this this works. I like this. This works. JTG MVP Kane. Versus Umaga, Kali, and Sandman. Heck yeah. And voila, we have our show for next week, which is awesome. So folks, with, it, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Please do leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the BBTV channel. I thank you guys again for liking this series. Can't wait to do this episode with you guys next week. Peace out, everybody, and subscribe. Stay off the hook.